Hi, this is Priscilla from Blue Weight Fit and welcome to week four of our holiday survival series. Today we're going to talk a little bit about a game plan. And if you recall in week one, I had you pull out your calendar and mark different obstacles, quote unquote, events or vacations that you might have that would keep you from reaching your goal, whether that be maintaining your weight, trying to stay active, or maybe even losing some weight. So I wanted to put together a few scenarios for you today because I'm going to have you go through each of those obstacles and put down a few steps that you're going to take in order to make them healthier for you. So the couple scenarios that I put up here on the board, number one is a vacation and number two is the company party. So let's just start with a vacation. Let's say that I'm going to visit my parents during Christmas time. I'm going for four days. What kind of things could I do to make that vacation away healthier? And I'm just gonna write a couple of things down. Number one, I am going to put together two workouts before I go and take them with me. Since I'm gonna only be there for four days, two workouts, two to three should be sufficient. <coughs> Secondly, I'm gonna to aim to work out two to three times while I'm there. So I'm gonna write that down. Exercise. And then lastly, I'm going to try to recruit someone so I don't feel like I'm doing everything by myself. So there you go. There are my three things that I'm going to take proactively, steps to make this a healthier vacation away. Number two is my company party. And unless it's a new company or even on the vacation, for both of these, you most of us know what we're getting into. We know whether there's going to be a lot of food served, maybe what kind of food. We'll know whether there'll be alcohol served. We'll know a little bit about the behavior of the company that we're either having or we're going to visit, whether they get up and work out, whether they eat fatty foods or they pretty, stay pretty lean. And so that's going to help us decide what kind of steps we're going to take in order to make it a good event for us. So for the company party, let's say that I'm gonna to go to um, an event where the food is buffet style. It's going to be available to everybody. There will also be, let's say, an alcohol bar, wine, alcohol, wine, beer, and the like. And so what I'm gonna do for that event, knowing that it's just gonna be basically kind of a free-for-all, is I'm gonna choose a plate, preferably a small plate, and everything that I eat is gonna go on the plate. That way it's visual, it's right there in front of me, I have an idea of what I'm consuming instead of just using your hands and grazing. So I'm gonna put down small plate. I'm also, before I even go, I'm gonna either drink something or I'm gonna eat something nutritious that works with my diet plan or whatever I'm eating, you know, my, my lifestyle. And so for this, I'm just gonna put drink water. That way I'm a little bit full by the time I'm get, I get there, but I'm not, you know, I'm not completely full that I can't enjoy myself. The last thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna park, once I get my food, I'm gonna park myself away from the food table so that I can have conversation there instead of being right next to it. And if the weather is good and I have the access of being outside, I'll probably go outside. And because it just eliminates background noise, but it also eliminates the smells and everything that's associated with the food so that I don't overeat. Now on each of these, I'm gonna pick one that I feel is the most important one. So if whatever happens, I'm not able to get anything, drink anything nutritious, they have these big plates and I don't have a choice, then at least I can choose one of them that I feel like, okay, I was able to do that. So for my vacation, I want to get the exercise in. So I'm going to try really hard to get two to three times while I'm there and exercise in. So I'm going to start that. Even if I don't bring anything with me or I can't do that workout and no one wants to join me, I still want to get it in. On the company party, I'm going to pick the park away from the food table. And that way I'm going to shoot for that one. Of course, I want to hit the other ones as well. So take this, apply it to your calendar, and make a simple, you wanna keep it simple, simple things that you can do to make each of those events healthier for you. Your weekly challenge is to let me know about one event that you're going to have in your future 
and the starred item that you're going to focus on for that one event. And that's it. That's all there is on week four. So if you want to add to our comments, check it out. They're posted down here, Twitter at hashtag HolidaySS2014. Or you can check us out on our website at BlueWayFitOcala.com. Thanks for watching, guys.